Hello, my beautiful fart faces. Today we're going to open up another painting from my haul from Dye Moon Shop or DIY Moon Shop, but I have learned that apparently they're called Dye Moon Shop. Anyways, if you're new here and you like diamond painting and you'd love to see my Dye Moon Shop unboxing, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. I post new videos on an almost daily basis. So let's get started. Previously, I unboxed some, I forget what it's called, the Moss Lady or something from Dye Moon Shop. And that was one of the first paintings that I that I had from Dye Moon Shop. So it's like really exciting because this is like all from my first order. So let's unbox this top one. Um, these are the drills for it. I have not looked at them because I wanted to leave the first the first reactions to share with you guys. Oh, wait, that's not the, those aren't the drills for it. This is the drills for it. Okay, so now we have to roll this back up. Sorry for the lighting, it's not very bright. It is a, a dreary day here in Edmonton. So here is the diamond painting I got. I got it in a smaller size. Lay straight, lay straight. Well, whatever. Be straight, please. Okay. Okay, it doesn't want to be straight. But this is the diamond painting I got. Um, it is called Sovereign of the Fae by Jenna Wing Hu. And it measures... What does it measure? It measures something size. Um, it measures 40 by 54 centimeters. So here is the canvas. This is really annoying me. Let's roll it backwards. Okay, so there, it's flat now. So I got a smaller size. I was gonna get the larger size, but I'm like, I want, kinda wanna see what the rendering will turn out in this size. And I didn't wanna order another massive diamond painting because literally all my diamond paintings that I, most of my diamond paintings I have are super massive and I just want to chill and do a smaller one. So this is her, Sovereign of the Fae. She's beautiful. I think this size re will really turn out well. So let's take a look at her face and the drill field. Her face looks pretty clear. The drill field looks very clear. This is a round diamond painting I haven't ordered a DIY, a dye moon shop square before because this well, obviously all of the ones that I just ordered are all round. Yeah, I think the canvas looks very clear. I don't really see any issues. Here is the thumbnail. Very pretty. Oh, there it says 40 by 54. I'm blind. Here is the schematic. Look, there's one AB, 310 AB, my favorite AB, Aurora Borealis. AB basically means that it has a special coating on it. And there's 38 colors. So pretty. What do you guys think of this? Do you think I got an okay size? Do you think I should have got bigger? Let me know in the comments down below. Let's take a look at the drills. So the drills come pre-baggied. And you also get a inventory sheet. Where is the opening? Here is the opening. Oh, and you also, it also has your name on it and the name of the canvas. I'm not gonna pull all the drills out because literally I won't be able to get them in the bag back as nicely as they have. So here's a look at the colors of this canvas. Some pink, some blues, a nice purple. And then here is the inventory sheet that it comes with. Does G stand for good? Good, G, good. Um, you can technically, I don't know. What I might do is I might use this inventory sheet for kitting up my, my drills and I might just use this column because we don't need to know how many there are, how many bags, and this this is kind of hard to see when it's printed like this. So I, yeah, I would just use the DMC column. I would use my 
Xyron sticker maker and just use this column to make into stickers. So that's the little sheet you get. And then here are the 310s, the 310 Aurora Borealis. That's very cute. And I think this is the weight of the bag, if I'm not mistaken. I really like 310 ABs. Some people don't like them because they're not, they don't shine black, they shine more blue. But I like them. I do enjoy them. Let's roll this back up. And we'll see on the canvas where that AB goes. So 310, AB310 is symbol three. So wherever you, basically on the canvas, wherever you see black, that's where it's going to go. So along here, um, the bottom of her face here has a couple, her eyes have a couple, along in the bushes behind her, the tree behind her. Here, here. So not a whole lot of ABs in this canvas. Like there's just that one color. Um, you can get special treatments for dye moon shop canvases, but I just chose not to because for me, I personally like don't really care that much. Um, I just usually use what's included with the kit or sometimes I'll be like, oh, I'm going to use sparklers. So that's really all like... I'm not like, I want all the special drills and I want to bougie up this canvas or what, as Abigail Marie would say, but I'm just like, let's just do it as is because literally when I'm done my canvases, they just go back into a box or into a big portfolio and then they sit there. I don't, I don't know what to do with my finished canvases. If you guys have any thoughts, let me know in the comments down below. But yeah, I'm very happy with this one. I will put, um, I will put the price and shipping information here just make sure you take into consideration like I did order was it five canvases so I did order five canvases at a time and I don't know if that's why shipping was more or how much shipping would be if I just ordered this one canvas I believe shipping if you just order one canvas to Canada is 30 39 something 39 dollars USD but here's the pricing information, and I'm going to put it in Canadian funds because it makes sense to me. Um, if you guys have any questions about this canvas, though, let me know in the description box. Or let me know in the, oh my god, I can't even talk. Let me know in the comments down below. Um, should I have gotten a larger larger image? What is your opinion? Let me know. And if you're new here, go ahead and click subscribe. I post new videos about diamond painting on an almost daily basis. And I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye!